Throughout history, people have been fascinated by the stars above them. Space travel became possible in the second part of the 20th century when rockets were built with enough thrust to overcome Earth's gravity and achieve orbital velocity. Nazi Germany considered the military use of long-range rockets in the 1930s and 1940s. At the end of World War II, London was bombarded by V-2 rockets with a range of 200 miles that arced 60 miles high over the English Channel at speeds of nearly 3,500 miles per hour. Soon after World War II ended, both the United States and the Soviet Union developed their own missile programs. The Soviet Union sent the first artificial satellite into orbit on October 4, 1957, with the launch of Sputnik 1. Lieutenant Yuri Gagarin of Russia was the first person to circle Earth on April 12, 1961, in the spacecraft Vostok 1. This occurred four years later on April 12. After 108 minutes in the air, Gagarin reached a height of 327 kilometers, about 202 miles. On January 31, 1958, the United States launched the first satellite into orbit. American astronaut Alan Shepard made history when he took to the skies for the first time in 1961. John Glenn made history on February 20, 1962, when John became the first American to circle the planet. Landing on the Moon In 1961, President John F. Kennedy proclaimed a national objective to land a man on the moon and return him safely to Earth within a decade. After saying, one little stride for man, one big leap for humanity, Neil Armstrong famously walked onto the moon on July 20, 1969. Between 1969 and 1972, six Apollo missions were launched to investigate the moon. Before people ever set foot on the moon, unmanned spacecraft explored and photographed it in the 1960s. The Mariner spacecraft was circling Mars in the early 1970s, and at that time, orbiting communications and navigation satellites were commonplace. The Voyager spacecraft returned stunning photographs of Jupiter and Saturn, including their rings and many moons, before the decade's conclusion. In the 1970s, the United States launched Skylab, its first space station, and the Apollo-Soyuz test project, the first space mission to include crew members from two different countries, the United States and Russia. Dish antennas in homes became commonplace in the 1980s as satellite communications expanded to transmit television programming. The ozone hole over Antarctica was uncovered by satellites, forest fires were localized with pinpoint accuracy, and images of the 1986 Chernobyl nuclear power plant accident were made available to the public. Satellites used in astronomy have uncovered new stars and provided a fresh perspective on the heart of our galaxy. Space Shuttle After the April 1981 launch of the Space Shuttle Columbia, most civilian and military space missions relied on the reusable shuttle. 24 shuttle missions met various scientific and military needs before the Challenger exploded 73 seconds into its first flight on January 28, 1986. Seven people on board were murdered, including New Hampshire teacher Krista McAuliffe, who was set to become the world's first civilian astronaut. Columbia's disaster was the second most recent. The shuttle was destroyed after its re-entry on February 1, 2003 killing seven passengers. An accident occurred over Texas minutes before Kennedy Space Center. According to the report, the ruptured foam insulation on the shuttle's propellant tank and wing's leading edge triggered the accident. Second shuttle loss in 113 flights. Each event stopped space shuttle missions for nearly two years. Endeavour followed Discovery's final flight on June 1, 2011. Atlantis ended the 30-year space shuttle program on July 21, 2011. Gulf battle showed the importance of satellites in modern war. The Allies won the war by controlling space. Thanks to satellite data on opposing unit formations and movements, the featureless desert could be navigated accurately. Satellites helped the coalition win quickly, saving lives. Space-based technology will be used more for border security, weather monitoring, 
connectivity, navigation, imaging, and remote sensing of chemical spills, fires, and other disasters. International Space Station The ISS is a low-Earth orbit lab. This high-flying laboratory is a symbol of collaboration in space research, with erstwhile rivals now working together. The station has been continually inhabited since November 2000. The station is serviced by Soyuz, Progress, Dragon, Cygnus, the H-2 transfer vehicle, and previously the Space Shuttle and the European ATV. Space travelers from 17 countries have visited. Space launch technologies lower costs and increase dependability, safety, and reliability. Most US military and research satellites are launched using expendable launch vehicles. Other countries have launch systems, and the commercial launch sector is competitive to build the next generation. The future of space exploration. The frontiers of modern space travel are expanding beyond anyone's wildest imagination. Exploring Mars by humans is a long-term objective of the current space exploration community. Those darned Americans. Mission to Mars is part of NASA's plan to colonize the Red Planet by the 2030s. By working together, NASA and its partners have dispatched orbiters, landers, and rovers to learn more about Earth. To ensure the safety of astronauts, the Curiosity rover has collected data on radiation levels, and the Mars 2020 rover will investigate the planet's oxygen and resource distribution. The history of space exploration is a long and fascinating one, full of brave pioneers who have pushed the boundaries of what is possible. From the early days of sending primitive rockets into the sky, to the construction of massive space stations and the exploration of distant planets, humans have always been driven to explore the final frontier. While the future of space exploration is uncertain, one thing is for sure, the history of space exploration is a never-ending source of knowledge and information. For more such videos, do not forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel Explified.